Uh, I want to introduce you now to uh, one of the hardworking teachers whose dedication to her students and her students' future is evident and alive in her classroom. Please help me in welcoming Carrie Gervais from Callis Middle School. <laughs> Carrie Gervais, everybody. Well, I'm glad we're front and center because that wonderful performing group, Elite, is from the heart of Puyallup, and that's where Callis actually junior high is. So if you look at the screen, you'll have an opportunity to see my students who were participating last May over at Finance Park in Auburn. And they're all holding an iPad, which they were given a persona, not only an age, they were given a career with a salary, given a marital status, children or not, uh, debt, student loans, credit cards, and then they were to establish a budget. So what a positive opportunity. And with that said, Dawn Parsons, who is fabulous, she's their lead over there, and I have so enjoyed working with her. So what a nice tie-in with that. Thank you so much for being here this evening, supporting such a positive event. Um, I can't say enough for Finance Park and the opportunities they've given kids. So what I'd like to start out with is three shout outs. I've had an opportunity to be involved with this program for the last 10 years. And my first shout out, BECU, I know you're a major sponsor. Thank you very much. Um, one of their opportunities they provide for kids is this item that looks like a debit card, but it's not. But it allows kids the opportunity up to age 18 to open a new savings account, up to $500, 6% return. So it's a great incentive. I've had kids come back and share with me. They went and opened an account, so thank you. Additionally, Chick-fil-A. Well, not only are they the top in the nation, but kids' appetite definitely goes hand in hand with that. They provided last year 300 sandwiches for my students as well as the other Puyallup schools. Um, that's our own Puyallup owner and operator who did that for us, as well as an entree card. After our kids participate at Finance Park, they get this awesome little card, but I step it up a step or two because when we get back from Finance Park, after the kids have gone through and done their budgets, I get sent by Dawn a PDF file, print them all off, and then we sit down and talk about cost of living in the Puget Sound. It's a little different than Ohio or Kentucky. So we up those prices for uh, daily cost of living. And then I make them take it home and get a parent's signature. Once I get it back, then they get their elusive Chick-fil-A card. But definitely an enticement. And my last shout out is to an amazing parent that went on my first inaugural volunteer trip to Finance Park. Jeff Hardy, would you please stand up at this time? He's back in the corner. Um, Jeff who's affiliated with Edward Jones, he is one of their wealth advisors, an amazing man. I not only uh, have had the pleasure to have him in my classroom, because once we went on that field trip, Jeff said to me, Carrie, seriously, I can give you some more knowledge about investing and have your kids paying themselves first, and he has been fabulous in my classroom, as well as, hold it, Jeff, I've had his four kids in class, and to make myself feel really young tonight, his wife was one of my students too. So thanks, Jeff. Got the whole darn family in there. And now you, 20 times later. So thank you. So with that said, I want to just conclude with a brief acronym, PRO. I believe so deeply in this program. First of all, the P being pertinent. Today and for our financial goals, we know that currently 60% of Americans do not live within their means financially. This program is so critical in setting a tone for us in such a positive way to send our young people into their financial futures positively. Are realistic. Kids, as you had pictures of up on the screen, an opportunity to look at what's it really gonna cost. And as I tell them, if you didn't know this, the number one trend in America, 26 year olds move home. And some of them raise their hand, they're like, yeah, my brother moved home last month. I'm like, now you know why, because it costs to live out there. So looking at the reality of it all, and then the O, focusing in on the fact that it's ongoing, that we know we have speed bumps in life, 
We have financial concerns that throw us curveballs, but just adjusting. And with that said, it's not about having the most money in the world or having excess money. It's about having an enriching life. And Finance Park and In Tune with Junior Achievement have allowed kids to live and work towards their dreams and hopefully achieve those in the future. So thank you so much for supporting this, and the kids really enjoy it and learn from it. Appreciate it. Thank you.